hi guys welcome back to my channel my name is Vukumi thank you so much for stopping by I really do appreciate it and um so today's look is just uh, basically me reviewing another product that I love and what I thought about I actually dropped this on my Twitter and Instagram and I thought about doing different um, looks with different affordable products I know that makeup can be a bit expensive so I'm diverting into more affordable brands and makeup so I'm going to be creating different looks from glam to subtle to smoky eye to um, neutral to drama I'm not sure really sure about a drama but let's see so just different looks but let me know what you guys think it's just how I did my um, under ten dollars makeup I'm gonna leave the link somewhere and I created this cut crease that I absolutely absolutely love and if you have not seen that video what are you waiting for so um, I'm thinking of creating something like that so I'm gonna call it um, I really don't know yet but I'm sure probably at the end of this video I'm going to get a name for the series so anyways basically this video is just basically me saying how I went from this <laughs> to this I know eh? I know right? I know like really? really? anyways uh, so if you haven't subscribed to my channel I really really appreciate it kindly click that subscribe button and follow me on my social media platforms um, snapchat, instagram and twitter and um, enough of the chit chat I'm, I'm really not in the best of headspace right now but this is where I come to relax, I come to have fun and talk to you guys. So, yeah, let's get right into the video and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye. So, I'm going to start off using my um, brow pencil from um, Davies. This is actually a Nigerian pencil that I've been using since I got here. So, I'm just going to line my brows and fill them in with the same pencil. Anyway, to prime my eyelids, I'm just going to use the same concealer I used and this time I'm going to use Toffee and I'm just going to put this all over my eyelids just to give it that even base. I found that I like to do to talk more in my video than do voiceovers. Like voiceover is just remote, like I have to just, oh this is what I'm doing, nah nah nah. But I don't like it, I like to talk. If you know me, you know I like to talk. And this is where, like if you meet me for the first time, I'll probably the most be the most quiet person ever. You'll be like, this is not who she is on a video but I'm this kind of person that I like to know my environment first I believe everybody does that but it takes me a very long time to know my environment and open up oh my god like it takes me like if usually it takes 10 minutes it may, it, like if it takes a regular person 10 minutes it takes me like 25 minutes like so I'm just going to set it using my LA girl my why do I always forget this thing in my last video I did as well my Maybelline Fig Me Loose Powder. I have a lot on my mind, sorry, and the shade 30 d So I'm just going to use the setting concealer before it moves on me. So ignore the noise you have right now, it's my system. So I'm trying to work on it, but I got some new products from Colourpop. Colourpop. Yeah, if you guys know me, you know I love Colourpop lipies like they are mine. I even had to. Um, get new ones for the notion I used. I used that in my um, in my under ten dollars video as well. So I got I restocked and I got LAX. LAX is like the most pretty brown lippy I've ever seen on a dark skin girl. Like, look at me focus. But anyways, I got this eyeshadow, and this is how it looks. It is so pretty. It's like a set of warm colors, and um, this is how it came. I also swatched this on my hands to see how um it came out and i'm going to put the video of where i did that as well and um so basically it also has the names as well at the back from full zip big cocktail charms bling louis butter cake blah 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 all to french kiss so what i found out is when i swatched them was um the glittered color yeah the glitter uh the the shimmery one were really popping when I swatched it. Like it was so vibrant and so pigmented. But as regards to the um, matte ones, they were they were just there, like just there on my when I swatched it. But let's see how it holds up then on this look. So it's just a set of warm colors featuring from um, browns to orange to bronzy looks. 
It's just a set of warm colors which I'm absolutely loving right now. So let's just get right into it. So for the first shade now, I'm going to be using the Big Cocktails um, shade and it's a light peach shade and I'm going to be using that as my transition color going back and forth with a fluffy brush. I'm going to go in with that shade from the same palette, the Louis, and I'm um, just going to go in beneath the way I kept that transition color. Now going in with this absolute shade that like it is so pigmented and it's called Butter Cake. Like, see how pigmented it looks like, oh boy, like, it is so pigmented. This is one of the few shades that, like, yes, a little goes a long way, so you have to take your time and not pack a lot and also dust up the excess. Now I'm going to go in with this mischief shade, um, it's a dark brown shade and I think it will be perfect for a contour, I don't know, I haven't tried that, but I'm just going into the outer corner of my cut crease just to blend into my dark shade. And um, I'm going into that um, butter cake as well and see how pigmented this is, like this is just one of those few shades that are matte that are so pigmented in this palette when I swatched it. So I'm just going to put this at the middle part of my, um, of my eyes and just um, put, go in with the gold shade. And the brown shade is called Note to Self, and I'm just putting it on top and just to give it a very um, glam look. And this is me just feeling myself. Like I listen to music the most. This is why I'm doing this voice over. But anyways, let's get right into it. Now I'm going in with that very gold shade. Um, it's a very bronzy gold, and it's called the Spout. And this is just very very pigmented like this is a perfect go it's also perfect to highlight with and now i'm just going to go in with my gel liner from maybelline and um my bh cosmetics um gel sorry my bh cosmetics liner brush just to give myself a very good eyeliner with my um maybelline great lash and i'm just going to apply this to my lashes just to give it just to wake them up to make them alive and um, I'm going in with this um, gold liner from NYX I think I've used this liner a lot of times but yeah uh, now I'm going to go in with my lashes I got them from eBay I'm really looking for um, other lashes as well so I'm planning on exploring I'm going to go in with this matte and polish, sorry, with this Maybelline Blur Illuminate. It has this very hydrating um, feel to it. Whenever I apply it, it's not as mattifying as my other primers. And I think it says, primes the skin uh, lightweight, non oily formula. Um, for this video, I'm also, I also got two new concealers from Colourpop and I got the shade Rich 75 and Deep 70. Um, I really don't know if this is my color, but from what I tried, from what I watched actually, it kind of looks like the shade. I'm really hoping it would be good. So uh, so this is, this is the 75 and this is the 70. And um, I like the one, but I think it's very dark. I'm not so sure. Um, but this is way lighter though, so I'm just going to see how it is. So, uh, like really, I literally just got my complexion. <laughs> let's just see though, let's see. Now this is not it. Okay, this is more like it. But it is so creamy, I'm loving it, and I love the wand, the applicator. 
so this is for those days where I don't want that extra highlight to set my concealer I'm going to use this um, Maybelline setting powder in the same one and um, because my uh, highlight was not as bad as I want uh, I don't like to bake though my real techniques contour brush So I guess this is the end of the finished look. Basically what I reviewed was my Colourpop palette which I absolutely love. Um, it is so pigmented. Um, actually some of them are so pigmented. Um, the shimmer shades are very very pigmented and this shade, these two shades here are the, one, are the ones I used and they, they had a lot of fallouts as well but just one swipe and it is so pigmented and I don't know if you guys can see it but like and it is cheap so I absolutely love 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 it. it it gives it reminds me of this sunset vibe which I absolutely love and my lips is um LAX as I said in the video but anyways uh so basically this is the end of the video I hope you really enjoyed it um tell me what product you would like for me to review um, this is just going to be another name I really don't know what it's going to be but I'm sure by the title you got me seen but anyways thank you so much for staying up till this end i really really do appreciate it and uh i'll see you guys in my next one have fun and be safe <laughs> see this life me under like trouble one man thing is another man's trouble